Okay, this is a video to show you how to um, add an item to a record for a regular juvenile fiction book. All the juvenile materials are generally sent down to CKLS Technical Services to be processed. They make a record for you and then you have to manually add, add the items to the records. So the first thing you want to do is log in to Koha. And once you're in here, you're going to want to go to the cataloging um, search up here. Um, if you use this search, you may not find records that are in the record reservoir that um, CKLS have put there for you. Especially if it's a new item, you will probably have trouble finding it. The sure way to make sure you find the records there is to go to the cataloging once you get there, you have the cataloging search box. In the search box, you're going to want to put the ISBN. Always use the ISBN from the title page of the book because that's what the CKLS Tech Services uses. I'm going to enter one here. And then once you um, enter the ISBN number. You can either hit Submit or hit Enter, and it will find the record for you. As you can see, this record is here for us. The book is called Boys Without Names. You want to make sure it matches, and it does match the actual physical book that I have here. So I'm going to click on it. You actually, from the last page, you could go straight to Add or Edit Items right here. And if you click on that, it will take you to this page. If you click on the name of the book, it will take you to the record here. And then if you click Edit and go to um, Edit Items, you'll also get the prompt to add the item. So for regular juvenile fiction, the collection is going to be kids. It's always going to be kids for juvenile fiction. Um, the shelving location, we leave blank. We only fill in certain um, lines here in the items. When you click on the date acquired, it will automatically fill. You want to put your source of acquisition. If it came from Amazon.com, you want to type that here. And you want to put the original purchase price, whatever that was, in this case $14.99. And then you want to put the call number. Uh, CKLS Technical Services puts the um, call number labels on the spines for us. You do always want to check, double check and make sure that they do actually match because anyone can make a mistake and it does happen every so often that they have a mistake. So you want to type that in here. And then in the barcode, in the piece designation, which is the barcode, you're going to want to scan the barcode of the book, which is also put on by CKLS Technical Services. And there's that. The replacement prices are set for the children's department. You can find in your manual the list of replacement prices and use that for filling in the um, replacement price section here. This is a hardback children's book, and the replacement price for those are $20. Then you're going to want to go down to the item type, and you want to put the type of item it is. And if you click here, down here, you can see all the different item types. You scroll down to the J's, and since it is a hardback, you'll click on the J hardback. And once all that is done, you're going to click Add Item. And after you click Add Item, it should um, pop up. It's having a problem because my barcode is not unique. Because I used a book we already had in the collection, so I'm going to put one in that's not in the system. So you can see. And when I add it, it will pop up there. And you can see the one that I just added here in the collection. You can also go to the normal and make sure that everything is coming up 
um, correctly. It should um, notate here in the item type that it is a J hardback and that your current location and home location are Great Bend Public Library. Your collection is listed here. Your call number here, the status is showing as available. And it is last seen on today's date. Um, and then the barcode is here, of course. And you can have it print label. Some of the smaller libraries in the system have to print their own labels. So that is why that is here. And that is how you add a juvenile fiction book.